Let's have a go at factorising this quadratic using the grid method. So I'm going to draw up my grid. I'm going to place the terms that I can do uh, to begin with. So I've got this 3x squared here, and I know that's going to have to go in the top right. And my positive 24 is going to have to go down here. Now, the nice thing about a grid method or a ratio table is that the, the diagonals always multiply to the same product. Now, this diagonal here is 3x squared times by 24, which is 72x squared. And I know that this, these two terms here also have to give the same product of 72x squared. Which is why you might be thinking why you do 3 times 24 when you're doing the split the term first term method. Now, it turns out factors of 72, the obvious first choice is the correct one. Uh, 8 times 9 gives us 72. And 8 plus 9 also gives us our 17 uh, that we're after. Now, it's not just 8 and 9, obviously, it's 8x, or positive 8x, and positive 9x. And you notice they now multiply together to give us 72x squared. Uh, so the only thing left to do then is to factorise out these sides. You can see we've got our 3 and 9 here, so let's take out our 3x, which means the single x must just go here on this side. Now here, um, I need to make 8x. I've got 8x already, so pop me positive 8 there. Uh, down here, I've got 3x. I need 9x, so I just need another plus 3. And then, luckily, the last one works as well. 3 times 8 is 24. So we've got our factors. The first one is 3x plus 8. And the second one is x plus 3. And there we go.